Jeremiah 48, 42, Moab will be destroyed from being a people because he has magnified himself against the Lord. Icarus may fly high with his wings of wax, but should hubris carry him too high, his wings will melt, his feathers fly to the wind, and he shall come to a violent end. May those who have ears to hear take heed, repent, reform accordingly. You know, Tommy Nelson has profound truth that he has provided. But that's because it comes from truth beyond him which he radically acknowledges. You know, Dostoevsky was quoted by Solzhenitsyn. I had not seen the quote before Solzhenitsyn used it in the Gulag Archipelago. Dostoevsky was taking on the crazy ideas of this nut named Marx, a sad man sad family who couldn't even foresee the formation of unions. And Dostoevsky said the big problem with Marxism is not economic. Obviously, that's a problem. They always go broke eventually. The problem with Marxism is atheism. And I hear some of my colleagues talk about how wonderful progressivism is. That's the new term for Marxism. How great it will be when everybody shares and shares alike. But as Khrushchev found when he set up a commission to come up with a plan of how you move to true communism, where there's no government, everybody shares and shares alike, he ended up disbanding the commission because there's no way to ever get to a place <laughs> until the Messiah comes, it won't happen because you've got to have a totalitarian government that takes away everybody's rights and tells them what they will be allowed to do and not do, and that government becomes the God. And that's what Dostoevsky was saying. So I won't be back next year. I'll be back in two weeks and the week after that, Mr. Speaker. But I continue to have hope that springs eternal in the human body.